The Department of Defense just announced is deploying 5,000 active duty troops to the U.S. Mexico border. Good evening. I'm Angela Taylor. And I'm Marius Payton. The DOD says the troops are needed to prevent migrants from coming into the country. We know a large group is making its way north from Central America. CBS 17 Steve Sprasha is live tonight from Fort Bragg. Steve. Well, these active duty troops can come from all across the country, including possibly here at Fort Bragg. Now, the Department of Defense says that these troops, though active duty, will not be engaged in any sort of law enforcement activity, but rather used to back up the Border Patrol as well as other agencies. The president and others are very concerned about the migrant caravan. In fact, the president calling it at one point an invasion. The Department of Defense says that what it wants to do is make sure that all of its personnel are in place to be prepared for any contingency regarding the caravan as well as its members. Since we initiated our planning two weeks ago, we have completed updated assessments of each of our 26 crossing points on the southwest border and already deployed 100 specially trained special response team operators to prepare plans for each location. As information on the approach of a large group The big question is, will troops from Fort Bragg be sent? Just a couple of moments ago, I spoke on the phone with one of the base spokespeople who told me, quote, we are prepared to go if called. The whole thing hinges on how the chain of command works. The Department of Defense will actually decide which units are most appropriate for the mission. One other thing that we can tell you, any unit that is told it will be deployed will actually get what they call warning deployment orders. That will tell them, be prepared to go. They won't just send them off without giving them a warning first. Reporting live from Fayetteville, Steve Sprager, CBS 17 News. Steve